You know what day it is today? It's Sunday, right? What holiday? It's Easter. So a friend of mine, one of us who loves uh, you and all the work you do, we want to give you a special present. The Easter Bunny wanted to visit you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah? So, is it alright? You want an yeah, Easter egg? Thank you. <laughs> Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Yeah. Like we said before, welcome to Media Mash, guys. All right, just a few quick rules. Like, you guys are welcome to say whatever you want, just as long as you're not insulting the other person and their opinions. Yeah, uh, it's a debate, uh, so we're going to treat it like a debate. So, to start off this Media Mash panel, let's get mashing! Depression, and let me introduce you to some of my other guests. They are the wonderfully talented and amazing, also they're my ride, Meteor Mash, <laughs> my Meteor Nuts, and the Random Ramblers. Yeah. Give them a round of applause. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, All right, so. Hey, Yo, what is up guys? It is Pedro Tass, aka Meteor Nut here. Uh, thank you, Mr. Kate Dragman, aka John, uh, for inviting us and giving us this opportunity to do a part two of our media magic panel here. And uh yeah, Woo! round of applause. Yeah. Yeah. No, we're on YouTube. Sorry, sorry. And, uh, <laughs> also everyone say hi to YouTube over there. Hey, what's up? Hey! hey. How you doing, man? Hey, my nice shirt. No, oh, thank you. I, I I watched the show. I don't know if you heard of it. Nah. It's Adventure Time, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Great show, right? I thought it was. Yeah. I thought it was iCarly. <laughs> it was. Uh, no, iCarly's the other one. No, that's, <laughs> that's my favorite anime. Right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, the second, the Corey in the house. Corey in the house. What about that's all Raven? That's all Raven's a solid one. Hey, yeah. Corey in the house is the greatest man of all. I hear he's coming back. Yeah. Is he? Uh, that's all Raven's coming back around. Yeah. Does that mean Corey in the house is coming back in seven years? That'll be weird. It'll be like old. Older and living it is still coming havoc in the White House. So like, the idea of a sitcom like the later years, like why are you still here, Corey? I, you know what, Mr. President, I'm still trying to make that uh, that uh, that CD with my band. We're like 30 something now, but we're still trying. I so, Corey, I get out of my office, please. I support it, man. Yeah, right. Uh, so one question that I do have, uh, just because it's out of pure curiosity. Um, I, uh, I, I happen to uh, do YouTube, and I know a lot of other people do YouTube, um, and we, my friends and I love watching you guys and performing your show. One question I have is, have you, out of curiosity, ever seen any Steven Universe YouTube videos of any kind? And what were your favorites? Yeah, uh, all the YouTube troops are my favorites. <laughs> yeah. The I can't say which ones because they're all like extremely offensive. Yeah. Um, oh gosh. But yeah, well not all of them, but some of them. If they're, you didn't lose them at hentai, then they're not. Oh god. They're not that far. It's like they don't violate, violate, violate the YouTube privacy policy. Sure. Um, but yeah, they're basically like edits. Some of them aren't aren't like super messed up. Like uh, Mackenzie Atwood makes some really good stuff. Pearl yeah. Seeker Raptors. Oh my god. Yes. Some classic. We've been cooking up a new project lately, me and her. Um, I'm a, I'm a voice of stuff, I'm in one of her new videos. Nice. So keep an eye out for that. But, yeah, they're basically like edits of the show audio. So they'll take clips from the show and then edit the audio to make them say things that they don't actually say. Uh, and the possibilities are endless with every new episode. So, uh, you never know what you're gonna get. Interesting. Yeah. yeah. And then, um, a second question, and this, is, this one is specifically special for you, my friend. Uh, but, very simple question. Do you know what day it is today? It's Sunday, right? What holiday? It's Easter. So a friend of mine, one of us who loves uh, you and all the work you do, we want to give you a 
special present. The Easter Bunny wanted to visit you. Thank you. Yeah? So, is it all right? You want an Easter egg? Thank you. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Much appreciated. <laughs> yeah, get one. All right. Milky Way. <laughs> Hope you enjoy. All right. This is the first time I've ever actually laid eyes on the Easter Bunny in person. Yeah. <laughs> very special. What's up, Doc? Is there anything you want to say? Oh, um. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah. Actually, I don't. What is it? <laughs> Actually, I do speak. I'm a human being. You had me fooled. You had me Um, well, uh, this is for a question for my sister because she's a big fan of Steven Universe. And yeah, it's Emily. Her name is Emily. And, hey, Emily. Uh, What's up? Yeah, she's a big fan. Uh, she told me like the same question. What is one of your saddest and emotional episode you ever had? Bismuth. Um, yeah, it got it got real, man. Like the first half of that, I was like, awesome, new team member. The second half, I was like, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I really love going back and watching that one though, because it was a tough vocal performance. It was not the easiest day to be vocally, and it was under the weather or something, and just really trying to power through that. But I think it helped in the end. Um, because it, it got really nitty gritty in the, the fight scene, um, and just to to like have someone new when, when it's so rare and, and someone the gems know and can be nostalgic with, then all of a sudden it just turns sour <laughs> so quickly. It's, it's it's rough going, um, and it really reveals a lot about like how awful the past was for them. Uh, so yeah, I I do love that episode. I love when when we can do the 30 minute special. That's that's really a lot special. Oh, he needs a hug. Thank you very much for your question. Of course, thank you for asking. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Emily, this is for you, so I hope you don't get jealous and kick me in the butt. So one day, you're going to see him one day. So it just depends on the connection with the character? Yeah, I've been with Steven so long that he's just very accessible in my brain. Um, so it makes it easy. Farmer Lapis. <laughs> Actually, I'm Bob, the builder. Ah! <laughs> With an all new taste, because he came to this planet from outer space, a refugee of an interstellar war. But now he's at your local grocery store. Cookie, Cookie cat. cat! He's a pet for your tummy. Cookie, Cookie cat. cat! He's super duper yummy. Cookie, Cookie cat. cat! He left his family behind. Cookie, Cookie cat. cat! Now they hold SuperCon off Route 109. Yeah! <laughs> Evening, so if you guys want to come by, if you haven't been yet, if you just want to chat, that's cool too. I'll be there. Okay, I'm. Oh wait. I don't okay, I got. Okay, in front of the super con <laughs> sign over oh, there. Okay, well. It's a better shot. There's my great buddy. There's more lines. He's saying that's everybody. Yeah. Oh yeah, we're yeah. Yeah. So everybody's in behind the banner. Right. Come on, this one. Like it? Excuse me. Yeah. Okay. Good. No, I'm just want to make sure they're centered. All right. Thank you. All right. One, two. Yeah. You did. Don't want that for you. You probably shouldn't tell your girlfriend about that time you got kidnapped and put in a bubble, you know, it's not fun. Oh, yeah. Later. Yo, what is up, guys? It is me, and um, sorry that I didn't uh, uh, do the intro earlier in uh, this video, but at that time, I didn't really think about doing it. I was more focused on, you know, the last day of the con, just kind of enjoying the rest. It's been one or two weeks since Supercon Retro has passed, and it was a great time, had a lot of fun. Super happy. I actually really am. Uh, my friends and I had a great time. Supercon. Uh, everyone in the Supercon family. 
I want to thank you guys. I want to thank uh, specifically uh, Serena, who's helped me multiple times uh, during Supercon events, whether it was Paradise City or Supercon Retro or any other any other con that's connected to it. I definitely want to thank you very much for allowing us uh, uh, certain opportunities that you've given us at Supercon Retro, and hopefully we can rearrange certain things for Supercon once it comes, but that's another story uh, that we could work out. And I uh, also want to thank the people at Lupo Akari who helped us during our panels. And obviously I want to thank uh, Zach Callison uh, for being such a great guy. And that's actually one of the things I wanted to talk to you guys about where a lot of cool things happen at this con. Because um, in my point of view, I get, the, I get the feeling that when you guys see these videos, it's yeah, like us having fun at these conventions, doing all this crazy stuff. And we do. We do a bunch of stuff at conventions. We have a lot of fun. But also, conventions for me are also, I think for any YouTuber. I mean, if you ask HMK, he was at the convention. Mr. K Dragon Man was at the convention. Um, Kagi Films was at the convention. And um, I think... I can't speak for everyone, but speaking for myself as a YouTuber, I like to think that conventions is a hot spot where opportunities are if you're a content creator like me. Zach, uh, this one I'm putting to you, if you, for whatever reason, decide to watch this video, um, uh, I want to thank you uh, very much for talking with me, for... Um, doing that very fun little thing in your panel. Uh, thank you for being such a good sport about it. Um, I, I know that Johnny, who played the Easter Bunny, uh, really enjoyed it. It was very fun, especially because he wanted to do it in honor of his little sister. By the way, Emily, hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you um, are happy and hope you had an awesome Easter. In about a week, to, today is like 20 something, I think. It's like a, it's Thursday, April 20 something, I don't know. <laughs> Lost track of time. Uh, but in, in a week or so, we're gonna be going to Alcon, so please make sure to check that out. Please make sure to visit us. We're gonna be doing multiple panels there. I think like three or four is gonna be really fun, really cool. Uh, the Ramblers will be there. All of them are planned to be there, me, Back is ADGO Johnny, uh, and it's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, also, please excuse the background noise just because there might be people going around because I'm at school. After what happened on Supercon Retro, I'm very, very excited to announce to you guys that um, uh, at Supercon, not only are we, uh, hopefully, it's not confirmed panels yet. Uh, I'm talking with Serena, who's usually in charge of panels, to see if we can go, but. Uh, I get a feeling that we will, but besides that, one of the big things that's happening is that uh, not only are we working with one, but two celebrities that are going to Supercon, we plan on working with them. Well, the first one, we got into contact with them a long time ago, like a, a couple of, like a month or two now. And uh, I'm talking about Kellen Goff, the voice of Funtime Freddy. If you guys are familiar with the FNAF series, Five Nights at Freddy's, or Sister Location, you'll know that uh, he is a very, you know, very popular character and a very popular voice actor. Uh, I reached out to him on Twitter, very nice guy, very sweet. He cares a lot about his fans, and we are fans of him. Um, but yeah, we're going to be working with him, whether or not he's going to be doing a panel or a video. We just know that we're going to be seeing him and possibly, you know, collaborating with him. Uh, it was very cool. Uh, we, like I said, reached out to him on Twitter and he's very intrigued by it. The second person, actually, and this is why, Zach, I'm thanking you. Yes, Zach Calson, the voice of Steven Universe. You saw him in his video and you're going to see him again at Supercon. Uh, hopefully, I'm allowed to tell you guys that. Uh, Zach, don't kill me if you know, uh, if you're, people are not supposed to. But yes, um, we are going to make a video with Zach Callison. I'm very excited for this opportunity. I cannot wait, and it's going to be awesome. I already have the video idea in mind, writing the script. And very simple, very quick, but it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, Zach and I talked after his panel uh, over at his booth, and uh, we... Uh, made an agreement that yeah, we're gonna meet up at Supercon and we're gonna do a video together and it's gonna be really fun, very funny. 
So I hope you guys enjoy that. So guys, thank you uh, so much for watching these vlogs. I just wanted to uh, take this moment because I felt like I didn't uh, end the vlog like uh, the way I meant to be. There are people walking into the uh, classroom right now, so that's gonna be uh, something. But um, no, nah, with that, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the vlogs. I uh, hope you guys enjoy Supercon Retro. Thank you guys for coming out and supporting us. Please make sure to come to Alcon. May 6th to 7th is going to be amazing. We're going to be hosting a lot of panels. It's going to be a lot of fun. And a lot of YouTubers are going to be there, actually. And then later on, yes, we are going to Supercon. No matter what, we are going to Supercon. We're going to be working with Zach Callison and Kellen Goff. So thank you. And uh, with that, I will catch you guys later. See ya. And don't forget to keep on rambling.